गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू द क्लास दिस इज फिजिकल एजुकेशन पीरियड एंड आई एम मिस्टर अहमद टुडे वी विल डिस्कस चैप्टर नंबर सिक्स टॉपिक रिकली एंड जोन्स सीनियर सीजन फिटनेस टेस्ट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लेट मी गिव द इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ दिस टेस्ट द सीनियर सीजन फिटनेस टेस्ट वॉज डेवलप्ड एट फुलटन यूनिवर्सिटी बाय डॉक्टर रोबोटा रिकली and dr jesse jones in 2001 as such the test is sometimes known as the fullerton functional fitness test first of all let me tell you regarding the purpose of this test the main thing the purpose of this test is to assess or measure the functional fitness of older adults okay procedure of this test is that first of all place the chair against a wall for greater stability number second sit in the middle of the chair with your feet on the floor back straight cross your arms at the wrist and place them on the chest on the command go you will rise up to a full stand and sit again as many times as you can during 30 second interval count the total number of complete chair stands that will be your score but as i have given you the procedure you can have the procedure right now just before this trick here the purpose of the 30 second chair stand test is to assess lower body strength You will need a straight back or folding chair with a seat height of 17 inches placed against the wall and a stopwatch or wristwatch with a second hand to conduct this test. Instruct the participant to sit in the middle of the chair with the back straight and feet flat on the floor shoulder width apart, arms crossed at the wrists and held against the chest. Have participants practice one or two stands to make sure they understand the correct form. Now the actual test begins. On the signal go, the participant rises to a full stand and then returns to a full seated position. Encourage the participant to complete as many full stands as possible within the 30 seconds. When the test is over, mark the total number of stands completed within the 30 seconds on the scorecard. If the person is more than halfway up at the end of 30 seconds, it counts as a full stand. Follow these safety tips as you administer the 30 second chair stand test. Brace the chair against a wall or have someone hold it steady. Watch for any balance problems. And lastly, stop the test immediately if the participant complains of pain. procedure of the second test item that is arm curl test first of all in the similar way as we have done in the first one place the chair against a wall for greater stability second number same sit in the middle of the chair with your feet on the floor and back straight number third hold the weight in the strong hand using a suitcase grip that is palm facing towards the body that is be 5 pounds for women and 8 pounds for men on the command go do as many curls as you can in the 30 second time period do not swing the weight if you have started raising the weight again and are over halfway when time is called you may count that curl 
count the total number of complete arm curls in 30 second in the next clip you will be able to see actually how this test is to be performed this is the uh, the arm curl test and it measures upper body strength so you want to sit have your participants sit on the middle of the chair straight back women will use a five pound dumbbell men will use an eight pound dumbbell and the test is how many full range of motion arm curls can they do in 30 seconds so um, what you'll do is it'll show the participant so go ahead and do um, come on up give a quarter turn and then up like that so do a couple of demonstrations with the participant let them do a couple more on their own a slow movement come back down that's perfect one more okay now do a couple more as fast as you can good and rest now so you want to give them a warm-up like that so they have an idea of good forms with some slow repetitions and then of course when they do the full uh, 30 seconds they'll go as fast as they can now Mary Louise I noticed that when you came up when you went fast you came up and your elbow came up by movement of the shoulder you want to keep that elbow in as tight as you can to the body to the side of the body so don't let the elbow come up just keep that elbow totally tucked in okay mm -hmm. so on the, now stand up straight okay so on this one this will be the real deal and it'll be for 30 seconds on the command go ready set go good fact, good that's it see how that's staying stationary there and she has that rotation keep going and stop we'll stop there but you'd go on for the full 30 seconds and then um, count how many she did in the 30 seconds and that is the arm curl test measuring upper body strength. Thanks and watch the next test items of this test in the next clip because it becomes very heavy if we are having a single clip. It is Rick Lee and Jones. We have completed first two test items and in the next clips we will complete the other test items. Thank you.